Paul Katcheroff with 423byland.com. First, I want to say, ho, 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 Merry Christmas to everyone out there because it is the holidays and we are very excited because everybody said to me, Paul, do you have any of these RV lots left? I said, no, I don't. I'm not going to get any more for a few months. It's hard to get. Well, we got one lot before Christmas. So I'm really, really happy about this. I didn't think I would get any more. We're selling these lots within a week. So here's the deal. I got a winner, 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 winner right before Christmas. I'm pretty happy about this. Right behind me is Alta Vista. And here's the cool part. This road, Alta Vista, goes right to the entrance. It's just not too far away. Notice how great this location is. You come out the entrance, drive a short distance, turn right here, and you're almost at the lot. Really quick and easy. Now watch this. Look at this neighbor. Beautiful country property. Love this. I mean, this is great. He's got a beautiful little fence there. Really well done with the RV, with the overhang, with the barn. Looks really nice. Nothing over here. Very few people on the street. You only, about, you only see a couple. For heaven's sakes, this is phenomenal. It's hard to get properties without immediate neighbors. They're going really, really quickly. Okay, so here's this amazing neighbor. I just want to show it one more time. Great, beautiful job with the lot. There are two lots, 80 feet, between him and our brand new lot number 133. This property has got about 37 feet of frontage by 120 feet of depth, which makes it oversized. The average lot is around 3,800 square feet. I think this is uh, over four, so it's bigger than normal. The average lot's around 94 feet long. This is 120 feet long. You have so much more land. So check this out. There's one stake right here. A full 80 feet from a neighbor who's got a beautiful yard. There's nobody across the street. Uh, there's one gentleman at the end with a van. He's retired. I went and talked to him. One of the nicest people you'll ever meet. And that's it. That's about all you got. You have this gentleman. I don't even know if he's there full time. That probably looks like a part time or like he's a weekender. I would say the only person you'll ever see is him. That's it. That's it. So check this out. Beautiful property. You can see right through this property. Normally that means that the clearing won't be bad at all. Beautiful oak tree, perfectly straight. We want to leave that to the right of the oak tree. I can't believe it. This is the easiest clearing job I've ever seen. You got so much square footage to work with back there because it is an oversized lot. All the utilities run at the front of the street. You have water and sewage here. Electricity runs across the street. Now check this out. Right over there is a transformer. I have a feeling you might be able to jump off that transformer. You just saved yourself $800. How cool is that? By the way, this is the cheapest, cheapest development you'll ever see in Texas. If you want a lot, an RV lot, right at the holidays, the street is beautiful, the street is perfect. Wide turnaround, not far from the entrance, about four or five streets back. It's an oversized lot and it's everything that people are asking me for. So I'm really, really happy because I can't believe I just popped this uh, this morning. Sign steel delivered. This could be the quickest sale I ever made because when this gets out on the airwaves, my phone's gonna blow up. I told everybody I had nothing else left. Well, I stand corrected. Lot 133 is a go. And I'm gonna go ahead and walk real quickly onto the lot just to give you a little more to go on. But no, let me see that camera, Miss Wonderful Camera Lady. Okay, check this out. Here's your one marker. And I always tell people, if I can walk through the lot, the clearing won't be that bad at all. Big, beautiful tree in the front where my sign is. As I walk through, very flat, level ground. Love it. As I get to the back right there, you can see one of my markers at the back. Right there, that's where we're going to head to. So notice as I walk through here, I'm going to try to keep the camera from bouncing all around. But as I walk through here, look, not much underbrush. That's pretty awesome. Pretty cool, good stuff. And this is a lot longer than normal. Normally, these lots will end about where I'm standing, right? But you just keep on going because it's oversized. You just keep on going. Retired lady at the back, just met her. Super nice people. Nobody to the immediate left. Nobody across the street. Folks, I, I pulled it. 
I did it. I nailed the final RV lot right before Christmas. I'm pretty happy because normally you can't get these these lots. Um, it's very cyclical. Normally it's after January, February, the market starts opening up and people want to sell. Well, I got one, so I really highly suggest if this is something that you want, call me. 423 buy land and have yourself a merry little Christmas. Thank you and take care. Hey, Paul Catrop, one more thing. Right there, right there is lot 133. If you look, that's where I shot the video. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna drive out. I pride myself in showing you everything. And I want you to see the street driving out so you know what you're gonna see. I want you to be confident when you come up here. So check this out. Okay. Pretty cool, he's nice over there. Really nice guy. He's by himself, no kids. He's a retired individual. That's pretty recent right there. This is our customer. Check this out, guys. Oh man, he's great. He is currently financing that lot from us. Love that flag and that Trump sign, pretty cool. Anyway, that's kind of what you can expect to see. If you have any other questions, 423 Byland. Take care, Merry Christmas.